Hi guys! In today's video, I'm going to talk about the Elemental Realm map. It is available for high-level players. For those whose levels are above level 90 or 100 or 110, I'm not sure about this one. But anyway, this map is very useful, but the monsters you find there are very powerful. They deal huge damage even if you have a lot of elemental resistance. Also, they have a massive defense. Why this map are so useful? It's simple, because inside of the Elemental Realm world, you can collect materials such as Holy Weapon and Armor and Helmet Shards, Glorious Weapon and Armor and Helmet Shards. You can't obtain Royal and Majestic Shards. You can only craft those in Harbor. You can enter to the Harbor map once you complete a Hydra run successfully, or you might just teleport there with a Hydran Ring. You can get a Hydran Ring by simply opening a few Hydra Chests. You can use the Hydran Ring three times each, but during two use, you have to wait 30 minutes before you could use it once again. And your question is the following one, right? Why the hell would you collect those materials? Nothing is simpler than answering for this question of yours. By collecting these materials, you might get set effects once you visited the Royal Set Smith, which you find in the harbor. There is totally five Set Smiths, whose gives you different bonuses. Let's start with the Holy Set Smith. This one are the easiest one to get. This Set Smith gives you Holy Set effects, which are the followings, plus 1,500 GP and plus 15% experience bonuses. You might think it's not a big thing, but let me tell you something. You might obtain these effects in just a quick 30 to 60 minutes, which means you don't even have to spend more than one hour to get 1,500 GP and 15% experience bonuses forever. You have to add these effects to your armor, to your helmet, to your weapon. Once you added these set effects successfully, the set effect will appear in the left corner in the client. One, try to adding holy set effects to your helmet, armor, weapon, cost you each 10 to 15 minutes of farming and 100 million yang, also 500 Gaia. I won't recommend you to go for the second set smith, which is the glorious set effect set smith. He would give you 1,500 GP and 7 movement speed. Also, it would cost you way more time than the holy set smith. And this one works with 40% success rate instead of 50%. Just skip this one. Third set smith, glorious. Set effect set smith. This one are different than those befores. One of the most useful set smith. He gives you plus 1,500 GP and plus 5% strength against monsters, 
Once you added successfully glorious set effect to your armor, helmet, weapon. He works with 30% success rate. Also, he asks for 100 million Yang and 500 Gaia, as each set Smith does. Trying to adding one set effect to your armor, helmet, weapon, probably it will cost you four to six hour of farming inside of the elemental realm. Lot of time, lot of patience recommended for this one. Fourth, Setsmith Royal set effect. This Setsmith work with a 20% success rate. Also, 100 million Yang and 500 Gaia. It will cost you probably hundreds of hours, but I won't say nothing dumb. I'm not sure about this one and about the following one. Once you add three set effects successfully to your armor and weapon and helmet, you get the following effects. Plus 2,500 GP and 10% magic, plus melee attack, also plus 5% movement speed. Majestic set effect. This set smith works worth a 10% success rate, if I remember well. 100 million yang and 500 gaia for one try. Once you add the three set effect to your equipments, you obtain the following ones. Plus 3,500 HP and plus 15% magic and melee attack, plus 7% movement speed. Most popular setsmiths are the following ones. Royal setsmith. Reason. You can get this effect fast and easy. Glorious set effect. Reason. This is the first set effect which increases your damage. Obtaining it will cost most likely 5 to 100 hour of farming, depending on your luck. Royal set effect. Reason. Second set effect which increases your damage, bit more than the glorious set effect, bit less than the majestic set effect. Most players who have serpent swords and armors plus 15 goes for this. So guys, looks like I have collected 14 pieces of glorious helmet shards. 10 pieces of glorious weapon shard. 10 pieces of glorious armor shard. It took me 40 minutes. Third set smith, which would increase my damage, would ask for 50, 50, 50 pieces of those items for one try adding set effect bonuses to my items. So, yes, a lot of time. Anyway, thanks for watching and supporting my channel. I hope this video might helped you a bit to understand how does the set effects works in Meetin' 2. See you in the next video.